Did you meet Sergey Kislyak in Cleveland? Did you talk to him? I, I'm not going to deny that I talked with him. Although so you did I talk to say, him. I will say that I never met him anywhere uh, outside of Cleveland. Let's let's just so say that much. The only time that you met him was in Cleveland. I, 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 what, that I may have met him, possibly, what it might have been in Cleveland. The person at the center of the dubious allegations of the Nunez memo is someone very familiar to viewers of this program, Carter Page, who appeared on this show three times last year and who has maintained from the beginning, without presenting any public evidence, uh, that he was the victim of a vast conspiracy to unconstitutionally and illegally surveil him. Now, with the Nunes memo release, that claim that, that Carter has been a, a believer in since the very beginning, that became the official conspiracy theory of the White House and much of the Republican Party. And the last time I spoke to Page was in October, when he said something really weird that now seems, well, oddly prescient. In the interest of, of really getting the truth out there, because I think when the truth comes out, when when uh, Speaker Paul Ryan says the FISA warrant or the the details about the dodgy dossier and yeah. what happened and all those documents around that is going to be released, that's what I'm really excited so, about. And I think that the truth will set a lot of people free. Wait a second. When Paul Ryan says that all the stuff around the warrant and the dossier can be released, what, did Carter Page know what was coming? And if so, how? That seems like that would be a really big deal. Well, we asked uh, Page about that comment today. He, he sent a brief response, but it, it didn't really address whether he'd been in contact with Paul Ryan or any other GOP lawmakers or their staffers about the public release of information related to his case or about the Nunes memo specifically. We'll certainly let you know if we hear back. And Carter Page isn't the only person whose involvement with this whole thing is under scrutiny. Reportedly, Sean Hannity has been advising the president on the Nunes memo as Hannity pushed for its release night after night after night on Trump TV. Hey there, I'm Chris Hayes from MSNBC. Thanks for watching MSNBC on YouTube. If you want to keep up to date with the videos we're putting out, you can click subscribe just below me or click over on this list to see lots of other great videos.